Hello, Omar. My name's Amy. Would it be okay if I examined you? Yes. Begin with light touch, using a wisp of cotton wool, or lightly apply your finger. Please look at the ceiling. I'm going to touch your legs with some cotton wool. Please say yes when you feel me touch you. Yes. Yes. Time the stimuli irregularly. Yes. Make a dabbing rather than a stroking or tickling yes. movement. Yes. Compare side by yes. side for symmetry. Yes. 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 Did it feel the same on both sides? Yes. Use a fresh pin to test pain. I'm now going to touch your legs with a small pin. Do you feel it here as sharp? Yes. And this as dull? Yes. Please say yes when you feel it sharp. L2. Yes. Yes. L3. Yes. Yes. L4. Yes. Yes. L5. Yes. L5 again. Yes. S1. Yes. yes. And S1 again. Yes. A hypodermic needle is not suitable for this test and dispose of the pin carefully after each patient. Use a 128 hertz tuning fork with a flat base. Can you feel this vibrating? Yes. Can you feel it? Yes. Is it vibrating? Yes. Can you feel it? Yes. Is it vibrating? Yes. If distal sensation is impaired, progress proximally until sensation is reported. Tell me when it stops vibrating. No. This can be a more accurate way to test the sensation. I'm now going to move your toe. Could you look at your toe for me? Demonstrate with the patient watching. This is up and this is down. Can you look back, look back at the ceiling and tell me which way I'm moving your toe? Hold the distal phalanx at the sides. Up. This avoids giving information from pressure. Down. Please could you look at your toe? This is up and this is down. Please place your head back down and look at the ceiling and tell me which way I'm moving your toe. Up. Up. Down. Thank you.